When you think for a minute what, what education is about, education is certainly about having the possibility to learn almost anything. Now when you think what open education is about, you may say that open education is giving the possibility to almost everyone to learn almost anything. To learn almost anything, anywhere, anytime. Just consider that we have uh, 400 million youth unemployed worldwide. That in some countries the unemployment youth rate uh, goes beyond 50%. It means that the job market is not working. And it's not working, why? Because the skills you need are not provided by the use competences. This makes the education systems in a way obsolete and this also means that we need innovation. And this innovation, this innovation can only be provided at this moment by entrepreneurs, by innovators. And this is why the market uh, which is behind education, which is behind what we call nowadays open education, is so promising. Because, because the public system will have to make a place for this innovation, will have to make a place for these creators. By 2020, we expect the global education market to reach $8 trillion. And if you just focus on products and services alone, we are talking of almost 40 billion. People are ready to pay for education. They are ready to pay every time their investment will guarantee them a better future. We are all learners. We all want to learn almost anything. And this is where the main challenge for education lies. And this is also where open education can make a difference. I deliver the contents in what we call a learning environment. The classroom is a learning environment. But now it can be the company. It's the home. It's you alone with your computer. I would like to show you just for a second what Khan Academy is about. Mr. Khan is a father. His son has a problem with, uh, with math. And so what does he do? He just tries to shoot a video explaining what the math problem is about. And he finds out that his son understands it much better. When you enter the website, you see there are more than 240 million lessons. But what the Khan Academy doesn't say is that there are hundreds of millions of lessons in the computers of the teachers worldwide. And these hundreds of millions of lessons should also be delivered worldwide. That's just why the universities are going online. They are going online to provide any students anywhere with the capacity to enroll and follow higher education courses. After the book revolution in the 15th century, we are entering in a new way uh, of delivering knowledge and delivering contents. The main challenge is not to lose anyone during the learning process. This is what adaptive learning is about. And this is one of the most promising feature in the field of education. This is where innovation is required, not only in the way teaching takes place, but also in the way we assess the learning of the individuals. We all use smartphones and we can do almost anything with our smartphone. And what is behind this is the need to reinvent contents, to reinvent knowledge, to adapt them to the new uh, tools, to the new specificities of these smartphones and tablets. This is what we know as apps. We have millions of apps nowadays. How many educative apps? Hundreds of thousands? Good ones, not enough. This is where the market is going nowadays. We such a promising field with so many important needs. What we need to do is to unleash the creativity of innovators, of creators, of teachers, of educators, so that we can all contribute to the future of education. We can all enrich what open education is about which at the end means, before everything, education. <laughs>